actually taken all the steps that I needed to to record the preliminary tracks. So that's 12 songs that are recorded, uh, one preliminary vocal, acoustic guitar driving the songs for now, uh, drum track, and a bass track for most of them. Um, there were a few that I decided to pull it right back out because as I'm talking to other people, um, such as James about um, bass tracks, it's like, Psh, don't even worry about that. We'll we'll we'll, we'll hit that um, when we get there. And uh, and I thought, you know what? Why waste my time? I, I have not been a bass player typically in the past. I'm an acoustic guitar player, singer. So it's definitely stretching me in this season to think about. Um, not just messing around on a piano, but possibly creating something that's going to uh, be recorded um, on the piano, or um, the, there's a good bit of bass tracks that I've done on acoustic. If you've watched these things, you know already um, that I've recorded a bunch of bass tracks on my acoustic guitar, and then put a bass effect on it and threw it in background because I didn't really need a strong bass led song so far. A good bit of ideas kind of rolling around in the old marble now. This week I've started to look at what each song um, will start to sound like and what instruments would be really good and how I want to do vocal builds. Let me give you a quick little rundown of this sweet filing system that I've tried to do for every person that's uh, contributing. So here are the folders that I set up. I've got uh, 12 songs in a contrast a working album and then this little guy upcoming is The Passion. Um, I want to make an album called Passion. Pretty excited about that. And we'll see if somebody else steals my idea first. Good for them if they do. Because it needs to happen. Anywho. Um, but there are those 12 songs that I've corresponded those to my Google Drive, which I've shared with the people that are going to contribute. And so I've got my 12 song lyrics and tabs and all that. And i got a song list. Um, right there, we got a song list, and that's pretty cool because uh, right there I've just planned out like what um, beat, how many beats per measure there are, and some goals. Um, got my 12 songs, go into my shared folder, and then here I've got uh, what I'm calling ideas and song content up top, uh, the preliminary recordings that I'm sharing, and then song lyrics, which is the shared copy of theirs, and then the copy of the song list there. Um, so inside the song ideas, I got folders. These gray ones don't have anything in them yet. These yellow ones do. But, so that's just um, a Word document for notes and little recordings. So they, and then here's the notes that I'm starting so far. So that's about all I have to show you guys as far as content that I'm working on for how I'm going to go to the next step. Never done this one before, so pretty interesting. So that's about it for now, but uh, just really feeling good about where I'm at with things. Um, moving forward, I am excited to be past this stage of really just feeling like my all my extracurricular time was consumed by this. I hope to get to a place very soon that I'm able to start doing the other uh, projects that I wanted to do, such as posting things about glory stories, which would be uh, testimonials, because testimonies are always flying. If you're living in Christ, you should always be walking in some kind of testimony of what the Lord is doing in your life or through your life. And um, God knows, um, surrounded by that kind of thing, my heart cries that uh, the blessing of the Lord that He's uh, helped me to experience would would become an uh, an outreach kind of thing that it would just automatically touch people around me. I want to walk in the full manifestation of sonship, and so you know where your eyes are is that's where you're heading, and and so the Lord has graced me with all kinds of fun things, um, but I have wanted that to get out there and get on other people too because there's a lot of Christians and non Christians that are just living in some pretty sad stuff. So uh, I'd love to be able to be a part of change and transformation in people's lives. Um, so I want to get out glory stories for testimonies to inspire people. Um, the Rhema words, I've done a few of those. Um, I'm interested to see what that will grow into, but mostly it's a matter of looking at the scripture 
and going, oh my goodness, you guys, do you know this is in here? And revelating with you guys a little bit. Um, I'd love to talk. A few people. A few people know I know how to talk. Anyway. <laughs> um, and uh, there's one more. For some reason, I thought there was one more, um, but I actually don't have one yet. So I'm interested to see what this other thing is. I feel it in me. There's something else that I'd like to do um, via posting or some kind of course on this or that. But i um, pretty interested in um, what the Lord is doing in me and just try to follow him one step at a time. It probably has something to do with next step. I don't know. I'm just living in what I call next step Christianity. Ask me about it in the comments. See you guys.